Nick. Nick or Nick? Nick. Where's that from? Nick. You have no Nick. idea where your name's from. That's fantastic. I like you already. You just I just don't talk to my parents about such things. That's fine. What's your name, sir? Adrian. Adrian, that's much more approachable as a name. Why don't you stand on this side of me, Adrian? Okay, so Nick and Adrian, the reason I've selected you guys from the audience is that you look like big, strong, manly men. I know it's Sunday, but are you feeling big, strong and manly? That's right. <laughs> All right, we'll try that again without the awkward pause. Oh, I'm going to ask you again, are you feeling big, strong and manly? And if you are, I want you to give me a... Like that. And then there'll be a smattering of applause from the Sunday audience. Are you feeling big, strong and manly? That was brilliant. And so was the applause. The applause was significantly better than I was expecting. So, um, Nick and Adrian, basically, what you're going to do is you're going to hold me in the air and I'm going to juggle those three clubs. So you're almost certainly going to be able to hold half my weight between you, but we're going to show you how to do it. So I'd like you to take your strongest arm. Normally, if you're right-handed, that's your right hand. Put your strongest arm right up in the air like this. Straight up. And then bring your strongest arm straight down to your other arm like this. That's brilliant, with your thumb inside on your bicep. Your thumb inside, and then, I, I haven't worked out how to do this in my microphone yet, so I'll sort of try to And then, tuck your other arm over like that. Inside, perfect, that's great. I know to most people, this is just folding your arms, but you'd be amazed at how many people get this wrong, so we do need to demonstrate. So I'm just gonna get a microphone stand, just very, very quickly. Can I have a microphone stand, uh, please, Mr. Soundman? Uh, an empty one, preferably, yeah, that's great, thank you very much. So, Nick and, oh brilliant, you're doing a, you're doing a spontaneous can-can, that's uh, it's fantastic. I think we've got some can-can on in a bit, actually, they're, they're, they're incredibly hot. It's just one of those things where a load of people come on who are way out of your league and you just stand at the front going, oh my god, which way have yeah. So, Nick and Adrian, here's what's going to happen. Turn around to face uh, each other. Take a step towards me. It's Sunday at Glastonbury, the chances are that one, if not both of them, are significantly inebriated. The last time I did this on this stage, and this was Friday, the guy grabbed hold of my foot and refused to hold me with more than one hand. So if you guys could be a little bit nicer to me, that'd be fantastic. So you, just crouch down like that, like stand here and pop up. This might take a couple of attempts. Right. I'm going to stand up. This is every bit as shonky as it looks. So when I stand up, I'm going to count to three. And I'd like the two people down here to get a massive round of applause. One... Can you come a little bit closer, please? Because it's nowhere near Christmas and I'm not a wishbone. That's fantastic. Everybody together, give them a giant round of applause. One, two, three! That's amazing. Thank you. I need some... This young lady here in the purple, can I ask you to walk up the rope, please? And just pass those three clubs up to my hand. <laughs> pass the three clubs up to me. That's fantastic. One at a time, brilliant, making my life ever so slightly easier. Thank you, sweetheart. Can you take hold of this and just put it back on the microphone stand for me as well? I apologise for that, it's my job to get it right and not 
Seekers, can I please get an enormous round of applause for Neek and Adrian, who had no idea that was going to happen to them. Quite frankly, neither of them wanted it to until it did. Thank you very much, Adrian. You're an absolute gent and a scholar. Please go and grab a seat uh, and don't uh, and don't go anywhere because the next act is fantastic. The next.